here's the other. This would probably be a six lot too. I would say. Yeah, there's One, nothing two, here. One, two, three, and then three down there. There's nothing. So then there's two available. Hey, Albert, 1852. I always wondered when he was born, 1852. May 7, 18. Well, 1918, okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Betty was 1858. Two, 19 days before I was born. Yeah, I like the, the two, to, the stone together. It was such a strange looking stone and the picture that I seen is like a real tall, skinny, antique looking type, black and white. And you can't miss it. They took a picture of that stone when it was brand new. 1858, so she was 90. Whoever did the digging then knew how to do it. Yeah. Whoever's doing it now doesn't. Who's up there? That's uh, Ernest and Blaine. Where is um, Albert Jr. and his wife? They're over in the new part of the cemetery, and I don't know where it's okay. I've seen their graves, but I don't even know where they're at. Um, Sheila, if anybody would know, it would be Sheila. Albert and... Uh, I mean, Ernest and Blanche and Albert and Thelma never had children. Neither of them did. They're over in that cemetery where Sheila's mom and dad died. I remember there. going to his funeral. I don't know where the buried. I, I can't tell. You. I do remember going to his funeral. My grandpa was all upset, like he thought he was going to die that minute. 1852, holy Christ, he was 10 years older than Grandma's dad. Matter of fact, when I go back, oh, well, shit. Well, I'm, Grandpa was like 12 years, almost 10 years older than Grandma. Yeah, because he was born 1862, Francis. Mm -hmm. 